dear students please note down the notes of this lecture are available in the description of video please download your notes dear students today we will cover another important topic for bsc second year four semester students that is venus system of fluke and this system includes following components first is system of vena cava it is formed by three vena cava right and left precavals or vena cava and third one is posterior vena cava or post caval all these three vena cava right left precavals and this posterior vena cava post caval open in this additional chamber it is sinus venosus each precaval is formed by the union of three large blood vessels one is external jugular second is innominate vein and the third one is subclavian vein this external jugular it is formed by the union of two veins one is lingual vein that collects blood from lingua tongue region this mandibular vein it collects blood from the lower jaws and this innominate vein its two branches are one is internal jugular vein that brings blood from brain eyes and the subscapular vein it brings deoxygenated blood from the shoulder region this subclavian vein its two main branches are one is brachial that brings blood from four limbs and the musculocutaneous vein it brings blood from muscles of anterior region head region thoracic region neck region cervical as well as the cutaneous it means this musculocutaneous vein brings blood from muscles of anterior region and skin this post caval posterior vena cava it brings blood from the kidneys through five or six pairs of renal veins a pair of genital veins from gonads and from the liver a pair of hepatic veins all these veins renal veins genital veins and hepatic veins collectively constitute one large blood vessel this one is post caval or posterior vena cava which opens in this additional chamber sinus venosus portal system in this venous system two portal systems are well developed one is renal portal system and second is hepatic portal system in this renal portal system blood from the lower body parts that comes here in kidneys no down one is femoral vein that brings blood from thigh region this another blood vessel it is sciatic vein and it brings blood from lower parts of foot hind limbs like shank and foot both femoral and sciatic veins unite to produce femora renal vein and it collectively constitute renal portal vein that also receives one dorsal lumbar vein it brings blood from dorsal abdominal muscles in this hepatic portal system two main veins one is hepatic in this hepatic portal system two blood vessels one 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 is hepatic portal and second one is anterior abdominal vein this anterior abdominal vein it is formed by the union of both sides of right left pelvic veins these pelvic veins unite to produce this anterior abdominal vein no down this one also brings blood from urinary bladder through vesicular vein 
एंड एपीगैस्ट्रिक वेन फ्रॉम द एबडोमिनल मसल्स ऑफ बॉडी दिस हैपेटिक पोर्टल वे दिस हैपेटिक पोर्टल वेन इट ब्रिंग्स ब्लड फ्रॉम ऑल ओवर द एलिमेंट्री कैनाल From the rectum region, it receives rectal vein. From the spleen, it receives blood vessel that is splenic vein. From the ileum region, this small intestine, iliac region, these are intestinal veins or iliac veins. From this, duodenum, the blood vessel is duodenal vein. Pancreas, the pancreatic vein. from the stomach the gastric veins all these blood vessels unite and collectively constitute hepatic portal system hepatic portal vein that opens here in this liver and dear students third component of this venous system that is pulmonary system in this system the pulmonary system that the oxygenated blood from the lungs that is collected by right and left pulmonary veins and both these right and left pulmonary veins which bring oxygenated blood in left atria this is all about venous system of frog rana tigrina thank you